celebrate the lives of Charlie and Braden. And this is a chance to bring our community together to honor them. And uh, I welcome everybody. Uh, we'd like to involve all of you in the process as well as the kids. Um, we'd like to talk a little bit about uh, the grieving process and uh, how we feel about things. Um, I'd like to first introduce Mark Lane, who was the heartbeat behind this idea with his children attending the school. So, Mark. Yes, thank you all for coming. Uh, I'm honored here to be a part of putting this in the ground for all of you to have a safe and uh, honorable place to come and remember the kids. Uh, I think it will be a good thing for the children who attend here, the new Charlie, to just have a place to come and mourn and to feel safe and remember them as kids that were, you know, fun to be around, happy, live life and not the tragic that happened. And uh, a friend of ours that would like to speak on that is Jennifer Williams. It is fitting that we plant this tree and place this plaque here to show a long lasting tribute to honor the memory of the boys. Heavenly Father, the beauty I ask of you to wrap your arms tree around all of us right now. Back those Fill our hearts with comfort and, and even joy as we know Charlie, Braden, and Susan are safe now. We know by your de demonstrations to us that your love for us is real, and for those that believe all you have promised is true and great. So as this tree grows by his design, let it be a memory for all of us to enjoy its beauty and splendor. I ask you to stay strong in each one of our hearts in, in the coming days, turn to years. Let us not forget that you're never far away. All we need is to hear the wind whisper your sweet message. In Jesus' name, amen. Charlie and Braden Powell, February 5th, 2012. <laughs> 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 